probably it's the first name in that sheet which is drawing the attention, but at the same time, significantly, Selby have rung the changes. Petter is dropped. Nyobi is dead on the consigned to the bench. Blinker is back in. And there he is, Ian Wright, one of the most flamboyant strikers in recent times, Arsenal's record goal scorer, English international, television host, about to enjoy what he hopes will be a triumphant end to his career. Well, even in a warm-up, Ian Wright looked an exciting figure, and I must say there's a, a great air of expectancy about this. Celtic having had a, that terrible blow, there's no question about it. The absence of uh, Henrik Larsson, I think, has affected the morale of the team apart from anything else. And maybe not surprisingly, taking a little time to recover from it. He meant so much to the club. Just uh, flipped away there by Biduka. Not a happy hunting ground for uh, Kamarnock. This is their 21st attempt to beat Celtic away from home since the last time. That's not a bad ball across there, and it's almost there. Well, he knew exactly where to go. Running into the right space, the right time, just a little beyond, and it might have been touched, and that was important. He shone his appetite immediately. Very poor ball by Dindal, and now Celtic flooding forward. That's a lovely ball into the new cup. And it just passed. That's a great save by Michael Watt. It didn't look as if Viduka could get anything at all out of that. That shows you the quality of his play. Look where he is now. Seemed to have lost it there. Seemed to have no options at all. Look at that little curl round there. Brilliantly stopped. Here's Jeffrey. Touch across. Coco scored! Well, well, well. How on air did he outjump the centre of defence there? It looked... To be honest, it, it looked uh, a reasonable ball, but not all that lethal. And it says much for the spring and the heel of the Frenchman. Here it is going across there. And Kokar did splendidly to get up there and put it away. And there's Gould getting to that. Riley came up. Saw the opening. Took his opportunity, and that was a well-hit shot. That certainly was stopped by Gould, or else it was in the net behind him. There's a short one. But he will let fly, and that must be in. He's done it! Right to Scott! A blunder by Michael Watt. And one of the great predators in modern football accepts an invitation like that but wait a minute now it's been chopped off it's not counting and I'd like to see that one again it's played in here there's a shot now and it looked as if the linesman on this side had spotted him in the offside position before he made that that is a huge anti-climax for this large crowd. All Celtic now towards half time. Well, there seemed to be a bit of mixing there, there's no doubt about it. Well, this is what brought it about. Right going in there. Up he comes. Of go Kamarnock. Well, I did say at the start this is not a happy hunting ground for them, but nevertheless, last season Celtic did find it hard going against the Kamarnock, scoring the least number of goals against the Rugby Park side and then the Premier Division side. So I think they're getting a, a little sample of that again this afternoon. Resolute uh, display by Kamarnock against a Celtic team that I don't think there's any question about it, and still badly, badly affected by that terrible injury to Henry Larson. Viduka, good run by Viduka. Well, he's skinning Dindaloo. Is it very wide, though? Moravchik! And it just passed. There must have been the most amazing swerve in that ball. And if you had it 
to the slippery condition here. Watch it coming in. The goalkeeper slipping. There really was swerving it, and they were lucky to survive that one. Now the Raptors beginning to play. That must be this game, yes, He's got the equaliser. Suddenly they found a gap in a commodic defence. Right getting the initial touch. And Viduka putting it away. And you felt that goal was bound to come, given the fact that Komarik seemed set back on the heels. Not the easiest of one to take, but a challenge by the defender. But he remained perfectly cool. One each. Durant giving it away too easily. Well, certainly a red card there. Yes, he did have a kick. How stupid can you get? Good for Abchik. Beautiful ball inside again. Yes, Maduka. Brilliant header. A really marvellous cross there. And I said earlier on, Maratchik had to contribute something to this game. He'd done nothing in the first half now look at this beautifully curved ball and the strength and the power of Viduka paying off there 2-1 and the Ramchik he's really turning it on now well Viduka hovering in the middle again it's an enticing one again Baduka, incredibly. Rising above everybody else. A brilliant hat-trick by Baduka. Nobody covering him. And I think even at this stage, it puts the game well beyond any doubt. by Petrov. Very good. Pace there, right, coming in. Takes the paint off the crossbar. And he's appealing to the crowd, what else can I do to put it in the back of the net? Look at the agility of the man coming in here. Absolute determination to get between the two players. They believe. Set. Play by Celtic, knocking the ball around well. Macho picking up, I think he'll let fly himself. Oh, that's a great goal! He's done it! Parkhead rejoices as Ian Wright, after so many near misses, flies up there. And no half measures with this man, he did it in spectacular fashion. All credit to the youngster inside him, who's learning his trade. And there's an Aster Krasner at work. 4-1, and he loves every minute of this. He's right. Macho putting it back in there. Bully, can he put it away? Wonderful triangular move. Number five. And just watch how this all started from right. Magnificent pass across here. Good perception by Virgil to lay it back. And there's the chest and then the foot of Burley coming in there, giving support. And there was no doubt where that was going to end up eventually. The Celtic run away with this. Good play by Durant Bray. And there goes the final whistle as Celtic Park rises to a really remarkable second half performance by Celtic.